and the noise level continues because the incoming batsman is Saurav Ganguly. If you are not madly in love with cricket, play something else, do something else, become a doctor, lawyer, whatever. Whatever you are passionate about. When you are passionate about something, you don't look at your watch. You don't, you don't tell your parents, oh, I practice for two hours, I practice 120 balls I batted over. You just practice till you get tired and till you are satisfied. Not only cancer patients, you know, a lot of people have come up to me that you used to complain about a life, but you know, you know, fighting a life and coming back to your field is uh, another inspiration in life. So. I never had even dreamt about playing for the country. I know it's a it's a big achievement and it's, it's something that every individual wants to do, you know, who especially is a sports person. But the first thing I realized that if I have to be a have to be a good leader. I will have to identify the right talent. I will have to make these players feel comfortable in. Getting the India cap from a senior player that you've looked up to, it's, I think it's one of the best feelings as a cricketer you can have. I um, want to achieve something really big and I want to be you know, known as a player who won a lot of games for India and uh, who scored a lot of runs for the country. Because uh, the passion which I have to play for my country, it's really intense and I really want to win games for the country. You know, you have to take risk in life. So. For me, being honest in life is very important. Hard work that you have to put, you know, irrespective of what your profession is. Look, I think all of us have our own unique uh, set of skills. Uh, and I think uh, one of the important things is not to try and, and copy other people. We can understand everyone is out here to win. Not everyone can be winners. But we can definitely win everyone's hearts. I want people to motivate themselves because it's very, it's easy to say to get motivated but the inner strength has to come from every individual. So, you know, get fitter, uh, come back to your life, come back to where you belong. When you enter, let's say, any big building, you know, right from the first man you meet to maybe the managing director, you have to be the same to each and everyone. So, uh, that's what life is all about. For me, leadership is about the trust you generate.